Kevin Rudolph made a name for himself with the song Let It Rock off of the album In the City in 2008, but his follow-up album To the Sky was unfortunately met with a lukewarm response. Now with the song and getting back to his New York City roots, Rudolph is back in the studio and ready to share a new sound on his upcoming third album. The recently released first single, Don't Give Up, is an uplifting song he said was inspired by his excitement to return home to New York. That came about right as I was moving back to New York and right when I got here. And, um, you know, I just was feeling really inspired and, and free and, like, just relieved to be back here and um, just felt like this feels right, this is a message, this is... You know, what I wanted to get back into was really music that has a, I feel has a message that I, I'm actually contributing something to the world. Rudolph had previously been living in California, where he worked as a producer and writer for some of today's hottest singers, including Flo Rida and Selena Gomez. So what made Rudolph want to leave all of that behind? I had to just get back to doing my own records for myself. You know what I mean? You get, you can get lost writing and producing for a lot of other artists and, and getting caught up in their vision. And then you got someone at a label saying, well, you know, we wanted a little more like this and this and this, and this is what this person, you know, and it's like, all right, you know, I wanted to start making records again that, that reflected really my own sensibility and, and what I had to say, you know, regardless of anyone else. Stay tuned to Artisan News for more insider information about Rudolph's upcoming new album. She says it